Hey, let's talk about how to do pull-ups as a quadriplegic. Um, I have set up this pull-up bar with a couple of the handles that you would like have on a cable machine um, because that way they are low enough for me to reach. And then um, weightlifting hooks. These are what a lot of bodybuilders use for like much heavier, um, uh, whenever they're doing curls or whenever they are doing uh, any sort of deadlifts so that they can save their wrists. Um, and we always seem to save our wrists because we don't have fingers. Um, and so if you hook them in there, uh, and I've actually found that if you do a, um, a grip where your hands are facing you, um, it saves your wrists a lot more. If you try and do it like this way, uh, it puts a lot of strain on them. But if you're doing this, then you can use your muscles a bit more as well, your flexion muscles. Um, and then I keep my chair below it because yes, hanging is good. Like I would love to be able to do a pull up and then, you know, just hang like this. But the problem with that is that then, well, if I'm not in my chair, I can't get back up. So uh, make sure that your chair is below you so that you can always get in. Um, and a lot of times this will happen where, you know, your leg just goes away. Um, I found that if you keep your feet on the feet plate, it also helps a little bit just with stability. Um, it'll make the pull-ups easier. If you want to make them harder, you know, let your feet drag. Um, but then I just, you know, do pull-ups and you can do like close grip. The cool thing about these, you can also do wide grip. So if you want to do more flat, you do more wide grip. If you want more bicep, you do more close grip. And uh, yeah, now we have a setup where we can do pull-ups as quadriplegic, great for stretching out your back because you sit so much, um, strengthening lats and uh, strengthening those biceps. There you go.